it doesn't make sense to hire smart people and tell them what to do. We hire smart people so they can tell us what to do. Hi everybody, today we will be talking about leading and hiring. We have spoken about this quite a bit in the past weeks and if you are interested also check out my video on hiring like Warren Buffett. Now we will have a look at another great entrepreneur of our time, the late Steve Jobs. One of his impressive statements is the following. It doesn't make sense to hire smart people and tell them what to do. We hire smart people so they can tell us what to do. Hey, my name is Armin Rao. I'm the founder of A. Leonard Rao, the Entrepreneur's Entrepreneur. I've been an entrepreneur, leader and coach since uh, 20 years. Today's topic is Steve Jobs, the legendary founder and CEO of Apple and one of his most famous statements. If you don't want to miss any video on leadership for entrepreneurs and young professionals, subscribe to my channel uh, to always receive the latest insights, tips, tricks and tools for young professionals and entrepreneurs and don't forget to click on the bell to always stay tuned. I thought a little about this famous statement of jobs and it made me believe that there are a few important messages in there that jobs wanted to send. Number one, you need smart people if you want your company to make progress. Google follows the same principle, by the way. They hire so-called smart creatives. Number two, ideally hire people who are smarter than yourself. At least in their area of expertise, the smarter they are, the more they will challenge you and the better the results will become. Number three, and this is a great message, um, use this expertise to improve the results of your company and your own results. So this is what, in my opinion, Steve Jobs quote means. What we can follow from it are five principles that you can apply immediately to become more effective as a leader. Principle number one is be humble. This means that you should check your ego at the door when entering the office in the morning. Put your company's interest first and yours second. Listen truly to your team members and take their advice aboard. By all means, avoid pretending that you're listening and then do it your way. This is the most frustrating thing for your followers. I can confirm this from my own sad experience. Principle number two, empowerment. Empower your team members and let them solve their challenges on their own. Don't micromanage. Smart people hate micromanagement and they need their freedom to perform at their best. Principle number three, excite them. Just communicate your compelling vision and invite them to support you in achieving it together. Principle number four, excellent hiring. Make sure your hiring process works well and a great hiring process involves at least the three following things. Number one, many interviews, at least five, better ten. Allow people to veto um, uh, the hiring of a candidate and only hire if all agree. Number three, check the team working capacity of a candidate through a thorough scientifically based assessment. And here comes number five of the principles that I see in this message of Steve Jobs. Trust them in everything they do. Smart people thrive on trust. They are so convinced that they themselves uh, uh, can perform with trust and they are eager uh, to perform. Mistrust actually reduces their motivation. Steve Jobs' rare talent to summarize a raft of principles and meanings in just one sentence um, it was legendary. So, uh, legendary. so apply these five principles and your leadership skills will improve immediately and the chances of your company surviving and your team thriving will really, really, really be higher. 
and you will become a better leader. If you are interested, you can find my contact details below this video. Um, you can click on the link and we can agree a uh, free consulting session. This is all about your challenge. It is not uh, a sales session. My life program is actually tailored to young entrepreneurs and leaders like you. Uh, and uh, it is uh, designed to make you a better leader. If you like this video, give us a thumbs up. Um, leave a comment. I personally respond to every comment and share it with your peers so that more people can benefit from it. Thanks for watching. See you next week and don't forget, lead yourself.